some cannibals here going after some beak beak things looking like they're doing a pretty good job yeah check them out I should loot these dudes and see what kind of weird stuff they have looks like they're all about the clubs looks like uh, there's a there's an army on that uh, horizon dude I know you guys want to sit here and camp these beak things looks like you've had your chance I don't know why it didn't even occur to me to loot the cannibals, just to even see what they have. It looks like they, they're all about some iron clubs. They might have their own specific gear that you can only get. Where's this guy going? He's running away. He's scared. His arms broke. Let's see. Um, maybe we'll check out what these guys have going on. Uh, they have a bad metal purity iron club and first aid kit. Anybody need a first aid kit? You know, we can get more first aid kits for these guys. Just because they're, uh, they're in the mode here. That looks like we're about to get attacked by uh, a big thing from across the way. Is this guy attacking us? Why? What did we ever do to him? I wonder if we get <laughs> I wonder who was that? Somebody's over here on their way out to loot. Yeah, I wonder if we're gonna get that coming up. Yep, there it is. Okay. Oh, he's not on thing. I don't know what's going on. Finally, finally caught that dude. Oh, we're after another one. There's a whole other group. Okay. I don't know what's going on, Taters. But everybody needs to get over here, I think. Oh, jeez. We got people down. Oh, wait. He's not down. Why am I thinking he's down? Oh, yeah. He is down. That's Biscuit Splitter running. Oh, oh, I see what's going on. Okay, everybody needs to get together here. We're getting a little carried away with this fun. A little too much fun in one uh, in one sitting. A little too many different fights going on at once. Alright, well, these guys are going after these guys, it looks like. More cannibals. Uh, that's a lot of them. I'm not real keen on that with Beavis being down. These guys are going to get there when they get there. Oh, see? Yeah. Yeah, the, this, this is specifically bad. Keep an eye on people going down and dudes going after them. And once you get in on this, we need to uh, we need to save Beavis from. Let's see what's going on here. Uh, that is that is now. That's your job. Everybody, everybody, go and rescue. Real quick. We need to make sure nobody's on the ground. That doesn't need to be. <laughs> Nobody on our side is on the ground. That's important. See, look at that. Another dude going after freaking Beavis. I guess nobody ended up picking up Beavis, huh? Your biscuit splitter, you know how to do a rescue, right? Hentai, do a rescue. 
Really, this rescue button is meaningless. Okay, good to know. Alright, anybody else down besides Beavis? We don't want to do a repeat on what happened before. There's that old fort. How's this guy doing? This guy is just unconscious for now. Alright, how uh, armor team is still trucking along. Managing their injuries. She's actually over half chest, which is good. This team has now got leg problems. It's got a, it's got to beef us down. Ooh, yeah, this this team is looking like they need some help. So, just for longevity, it looks like armor has it. Beavis, are you up yet, dude? What's your what's your malfunction? When is that going to be a reality here? Another two minutes. All right. All right, we are now living in a reality where we've gone back home and everybody's got heavy weapons and heavy armor. Or heavy as heavy as armor. Some people are wearing sneaky chain pants. But that's uh that's just the price you got to pay. And uh just to be thorough, the end of our process here, Amber. If we look at her stats, uh it's still the 11 heavy weapons, 25 defense, 21 attack. Uh, 32 strength and 35 toughness. Still 16 dexterity. Absolutely no dexterity gain there, it looks like. And if we look at the Norwegian, uh, she's at 19 defense, 24 attack. Um, she is now at 10. In, oh, she's always been at 10 in heavy weapons. Um, she came with 10 in everything, I think 11 in katanas. And let's see here, dexterity up to 22, toughness 28, and strength at 23. So now everybody's going to be working on their strength. Starting with Volata, apparently. She's the fastest person with this new armor setup. And uh, all the little training clubs are on the other group that's new to heavy weapons. The other group is... Uh, is now using some of the, the legit slaughtering of people planks and fragment axes and legit heavy clubs. It looks like Velada has beaten those three, despite, I think, never having used a heavy weapon in her life until that moment. I'd like to get everybody a little bit of experience before we head off into uh, cannibal lands like this. Hey guys, it's Casual Friday here. Just going to take off, I think, and focus just on... Um, not everybody has heavy weapons, but all the people that I think I'm going to worry about having heavy weapons at the time have their heavy weapons. Um, one of the interesting things I chose to do is not all of them actually are using Slim Katanas as their offhands either. I, Crunchy Tater Squad, I think when they're going down to the... Going down to the, the, the quick and dirty get from here to there quick without a lot of gear mode um, they have the the uh, poles they're using uh, which work as sabers so I think those technically level strength and dexterity um, which they can do with their offhand slot weapon and um, then I've got as many people as I want to bother <laughs> with having heavy weapons practicing heavy weapons I figured I'd go with all uh, non-armor clothing um, they got the, most of the people are got the stat stuff, the the fancy hats that give plus one to all stats, the martial arts bindings shirt, um, which give plus two to all combat stats. Kind of limits us to, for modesty's sake, uh, to have to wear one of three different kinds of shirts, pretty much, as the armor slot, uh, just to not be a creep with the lady characters. Um, Four different kinds of pants that are non-armor based. 
I guess technically these, these monk robes do have a little bit of blunt defense, I think. Oh, yeah, and the sandals, too. The sandals have a uh, bonus, too. Yeah, which one we call it? Um, athletics. So let's crank these dudes up into... Uh, oh, <laughs> it's just Beavis that got sped up. Let's let's get everybody involved on this. Now you can tell who the people are who've been running for uh, longer than the others. Who's new to running cross country here? That's no real surprise, but I figure we'll go and uh, see how long we can last before we have to go stop at a at a uh, stop at a town to heal. Because that is the one thing. We're not going to be able to stay out quite as long, I don't think. But hopefully we get to move around from area to area a lot quicker. There's a group of dudes. Let's go get those guys. It looks like... Um, the common sense of the faster ones getting there quicker is not actually how it's going to be. The faster ones are going to go stand over there, strangely. Okay. Well, maybe if we work as a group here. At least to go in the right direction. <laughs> Let's start with that. And build on it. Let's taunt them by our proximity. Let's do one of those little numbers. Proximity taunting. Hey, guys. I heard you... I heard you feel negative 60 at us. Is there something we can do to fix our negative 60 status with you guys? Um, is there something we can do to make it negative 61? Hey, guys. <laughs> Maybe if we go through them. There we go. That's the kind of proximity I'm looking for. Oh, there's the kind of toughness um, that I was hoping to avoid. Oh, and it gets to be night. Good timing. All right. This fight's turning around a little bit. A little auto-saving in the middle of it, just in case. Apparently that went well. Everybody's doing their... All right. Well, I guess so far we've got enough toughness to at least... Um, at least take too much damage in the first fight. All right, next... I guess the other good thing about heavy armor is it keeps you moving slowly so that it gives you time to heal a little bit between engagements. Wait a minute, what's all this what's all this angst? Is somebody making complaints? What am I what am I seeing angst? Somebody's on amber? Oh yeah. Do you chase an amber? This guy got a bounty? Nah. Ah, just bleed out, you phony. That amber's still like. I, I like the ones. I like the characters where the, the sword is going through the floor because it's bigger than they are. And so here we have it. Everybody's all packed up all their gear <laughs> to take with them um, we might just go ahead and go nomad in the experimental build I haven't fully decided that yet but that's kind of where my brain's been moving actually through all this uh, I'll save a version that has this base still but I, I'm going to just take this as a lot of lessons learned about efficiency and being spread out and prioritization and AI and all that good stuff so I think um, I think I'm just gonna import these two squads full of gear into a new game and we'll we'll check and see how that goes at that point there but uh, as for now I appreciate you guys watching and I hope you guys had a good time and I will catch you next time thanks
security iron club and first aid kit. Anybody need a first aid kit? Here, we can get more first aid kits for these guys. Just because they're, uh, they're in the mode here. That looks like we're about to get attacked by uh, a beak thing from across the way. Is this guy attacking us? Why? What did we ever do to him? I wonder if we get... <laughs> I wonder who was that? Somebody's over here on their way out to loot. Yeah, I wonder if we're going to get that coming up. Yep, there it is. Okay. Oh, he's not on thing. I don't know what's going on. Finally, finally caught that dude. Oh, we're after another one. There's a whole other group. Okay. I don't know what's going on, taters. But everybody needs to get over here, I think. Oh, jeez. We got people down. Oh, wait. He's not down. Why am I thinking he's down? Oh, yeah. He is down. That's biscuit splitter running. Oh, oh, I see what's going on. Okay, everybody needs to get together here. We're getting a little carried away with this fun. A little too much fun in one uh, in one sitting. A little too many different fights going on at once. All right, well, these guys are going after these guys, it looks like. More cannibals. Ugh, that's a lot of them. I'm not real keen on that with Beavis being down. These guys are going to get there when they get there. Oh, see? Yeah. Yeah, the, this, this is specifically bad. Cannibals here going after some beak beak things, looking like they're doing a pretty good job. Yeah, check them out. I should loot these dudes and see what. All right, we gotta keep an eye on people going down and dudes going after them. And so once you get in on this, we need to uh, we need to save Beavis from. Let's see what's going on here. Uh, that is that is now. That's your job. Everybody, everybody, go and rescue. Real quick. We need to make sure nobody's on the ground. That doesn't need to be. <laughs> Nobody on our side is on the ground. That's important. See, look at that. Another dude going after freaking Beavis. I guess nobody ended up picking up Beavis, huh? Kind of weird stuff they have. Looks like they're all about the clubs. Looks like uh, there's a there's an army on that uh, horizon, dude. I know you guys want to sit here and camp these beak things. 
Looks like you've had your chance. Yeah, I don't know why it didn't even occur to me to loot the cannibals. Just to even see what they have. It looks like they, they're all about some iron clubs. They might have their own specific gear that you can only get. Where's this guy going? He's running away. He's scared. His arm's broke. Let's see. Um, maybe we'll, we'll check out what these guys have going on. Uh, they have a bad metal piercing.